Hi everyone, it's Jody from An Eye for Beauty. And today's message, I want to briefly touch upon thought patterns. We have been experiencing a lot of changes in our world in the last year. Um, a lot of things have been difficult in some aspects to handle. And a lot of people have been going through hard times through the process. So I want to come on and, and every time I'm sharing messages with you guys and you're listening to them, they're definitely always going to be positive and uplifting, empowering and motivating. But we are still humans living on the earth and we are experiencing definite shifts. And in doing that, in living this life, you're going to have ups and downs in your feelings and your, in your emotions. You're not always going to be vibrating at a high, high state. You're going to have low times. And when you have those low times is why I'm on today to share with you what to do when you feel like you're in a funk. So the first thing that you want to do is notice what is going on. What are you experiencing? Is something going on in your immediate circle? Is something going on maybe with your health? Is something going on with a loved one that you're worried about? Whatever the situation is, I want you to just acknowledge it. Observe it. Be a witness. Like, step back. Take a step back and look at what's going on as if you were watching what was going on. And notice how you feel as you are watching or envisioning. If you that seems weird to you to like step back and imagine, that's what I do. I see a grander picture, but maybe for you, you want to just close your eyes and think about it. Whatever it is, notice. Don't judge. Just notice what's going on in your life. Notice how it feels. Notice if you have any tension as you're noticing what is going on. Notice where your thoughts are going and notice where the tension is in your body. And then what I want you to do is if a, a negative thought is coming up, notice that. But then the next thing to do is acknowledge it and say, cancel, clear, delete. And when you say cancel, clear, delete, you're not ignoring the feeling that is coming up. But if we get in a thought pattern of negative thoughts, it's a lot harder to get out of it if we keep perpetuating it. So the more beneficial thing to do is you're going to have them. We're all going to have them. I have them. But what I do is what I'm basically sharing with you right now is I notice them. Why am I in a funk? What am I feeling? What is going on? What is bothering me? For me, I sit quietly. I might make a cup of tea. I might journal and just see what's coming out as I start writing down what's bothering me. What is the common denominator? And then I notice if I'm still having those thoughts, you know, sometimes we have thoughts in our minds and they come into the mind and we didn't we didn't force ourselves to have that thought. It just was there. It just showed up. So when that happens to me, I say to myself, no, I'm not going to think that way. So let's say you're worried about a loved one. No, I'm not going to think negatively. I'm not going to focus on the bad. What I'm going to do is focus on the positive. What I'm going to do is focus on divine and perfect health. What I'm going to do is ask Archangel Raphael to come in and help me to feel healed and to help my loved one to be healed. And I'm going to send that to that loved one, that energy. What do I say all the time? Everything is energy. Your thoughts are energy. So when a negative thought is coming up, what you want to do is notice it, but then you want to shift it. You want to change it because you don't want to perpetuate the negativity. So a lot of people in this last year have been very fearful of the virus, 
that has been talked about. Rather than sitting in a place of, I'm going to get sick, I'm going to get sick, I'm going to get sick, oh my God, I'm going to get sick, I'm going to die, because a lot of people are feeling that way. How about if you switched it and did what I just shared and said, I am in divine and perfect health. My family and I are safe. Archangel Raphael, please keep us healthy, keep us safe. Thank you for keeping us healthy and keeping us safe. Archangel Michael, please keep us safe. Keep us protected. Shield us from any negative energy. When a negative thought comes in and you notice this pattern of the thoughts, I'm not going to think that way. Cancel, clear, delete. I'm going to shift it. Is it easy when you're going through the dark time and you're trying to do this, but you're having a hard time? Of course not. It is a practice. It is something to commit to, to do daily or each time it happens. Let's say you forget to do it or that's not, you know, you haven't been doing it that way. So you haven't been noticing your thought patterns and shifting it. When you realize that you haven't done that, don't berate yourself because you forgot to do it. Just say, next time I have to remember to change my thoughts, keep them positive, keep them bright, keep them optimistic, rather than perpetuating the negative. This is a true process that is not something that you do overnight. But with consistency of noticing the thought patterns, it will help you to get in a better state in your mindset and when you do that you vibrate higher and when you do that you attract to you those things that are in the same alignment of that vibration or that frequency of energy so try it no matter what you're going through right now if you notice a negative thought try what i just shared with you and try to keep that in the back of your mind tuck it away and try to remember that when something like that happens, if you're going through a tough time right now, to continue that process. And hopefully by doing it and reminding yourself to do it again and again, it will become natural to you. I hope that this message served you today and I wish you a great night. Bye-bye.